hello what's up guys this is john and in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to adjust your brush size presets so first of all what you want to do is go over to your windows and click on brush size here if you don't that's if you don't have it over here so here i'm going to turn it off and then i'll bring it back on so this is my brush size presets here so this is it here so as you can see i already have some um, brush presets here so all the, all I'm, what I'm going to do is just show you how to add more brush presets to this. So what you want to do is go over to this brush size here, this brush settings. So you can choose whatever size you want here. So whether one or 165. So I'm going to leave it here because I don't have any 165 here. So what you want to do is go over to this icon here, click on it, click add current size to presets. And if you add it, you can see the brush size presets here, 135.9, as you can see, that's what I'm using here. So that is it. And also, I'll show you how to use a keyboard shortcut to change your brush size presets. So I'm going to add another brush size preset to show you what I did. So you click over here and increase it to, let's say, 910.4. So you go over here, add current size to pres presets. You click on that, and as you can see, you have this. So I'm going to show you how to delete brush size presets. It's very easy. What you have to do is just go over here, right click on it and click on delete presets. Here, one, three, five point nine. Right click, delete brush presets. So that's how you want to do it. And also to show you how to use brush to change the, use shortcut to change the brush size presets. Go over to file, come down to shortcut settings, click on that. And then go over here to categories, click on that, go to options, go down to brush size palette. And as you can see here, you can mine is Q and W. I use my my hands are currently on Q and W. That's how I change my brush size presets when I, whenever I'm drawing. So that's it. You can change your own to whatever you want. And that's what I use here. So that's it for this video. If you did enjoy this video, please let me know in the comment section and I'll catch you guys in my next video.